everybody, it's me again, and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. We finished the main campaign, and this Herald is talking over me, so I'm gonna go ahead and leave. But, uh, we're not quite done with the story yet. We have a couple of restored memories left to tackle, also known as the Da Vinci Disappearance DLC, which I promised I would play for you guys once the story was over. Now, I don't remember how long this DLC is, but I do remember it's not that long? And, uh... I remember it's very good, but also, I've been reminding you guys on and off throughout this entire playthrough that once my playthrough of Assassin's Creed Brotherhood was over, that um, I would be closing the voting for the next replay between Ubisoft's I Am Alive dystopian survival type game and the survival horror game by Visceral Games, uh, the original Dead Space, which I'm actually very excited to play. And right now, Dead Space is winning, not by a whole lot, but if you haven't voted yet, this is your last chance until the end of the Da Vinci Disappearance DLC, because it's not going to be very many parts. So you guys have... I want to say maybe a week or two left, as of the day I'm recording this, to, uh, you know, to get your votes in. So, hurry up. Time's running out, because as soon as I upload the finale of this DLC, I'm closing the votes. So if you didn't vote too fucking bad, you gotta wait until after Revelations. How fucking far away is this thing? I thought it was a lot closer. Wee! Fun me, madam. Move it, bitch. That's not what I wanted to do. Watch me, asshole. Here we are. Ooh. I hope you. I must be getting lazy in my old age. I did not know you had returned to Roma. Well, I did. I've only ever played this, I guess, technically twice? I played it through the first What's time. What's happening? Raw. Ezio seems to be remembering something. Something from 1506. Desmond's heart rate is increasing. I'm administering a sedative. Give him the sedative! No. The missing data may be there. Oh, the lab. piece of Eden is useless until we have it. Let him continue. Yes, William. William. <laughs> yeah. Um, I played this DLC once through my first time, just having no idea what I was doing. And then, um, I played it through again, kind of, to get the full sync objectives I missed. So, yeah, technically, I guess one and a half times. So, I don't, I don't remember this DLC very much. I remember how it ends, but, uh, yeah, I don't remember much in between. So, it's exciting. Let's do it! Any day now. Thank you. Salai. Is that you? Nope, it's your other friend. It's you. I must be getting lazy in my old age. I did not know you had returned to Rome. Friend with a little less benefits. <laughs> Unfortunately, I cannot stay. I'm here to charter a ship. Let me assist you. I know a captain. He's very discreet. Thank you. Hang on, I have the name recorded somewhere. What are you working on? Oh, this? A hobby of mine. Of course you are familiar with Pythagoras. Remind me. And his theorems. The brilliant scholar from Grecia who discovered many secrets about the heavenly spheres and our cosmos. These symbols come from him? Ever since my exploration of that strange apple, they have been stamped on my mind. I found symbols like them in the writings of the Pythagorean disciples. <laughs> I am afraid the captain's name escapes me. The apple has been put to rest. Perhaps it would do you good to focus on painting. You seem to be doing decent work on this one. Three guesses which painting <laughs> You are it is. kind. However, even I can see that she is badly drawn. And that smile, overdone, meaningless. Ha! <laughs> Not for the painting. <laughs> I made a breakthrough in my research several days ago. A huge discovery. Salai, can you bring You're the... your own worst critic, Leo. Oh, he's not back. I know this I intended well. to accompany you to the docks, but we cannot leave my workshop without my assistant. Bene, an easy task. I am afraid you underestimate Salai. Hm. Wait and see. Wait and see. Suit yourself. You will likely find him at La Volpe Adormentata. Well, good. I have friends there. <laughs> so we're going to get Leonardo's assistant, Salai. Uh, at the Thieves Guild and bring him back to Leonardo's workshop. Do not dro drop below four health squares. Easy peasy. I just need to not fall off any buildings ever. All right, let's do this. I have to go all the way to level bed with Agora Ventada. Fuck! That's gonna be a long way. But yes, I do believe Sally has his own database entry. I don't know if we get it 
Oh, it fast travels us there. Okay, fucking perfect. Thank you, game. Thank you so much. All right, don't drop below four health squares. Done. No, it's not that easy, believe me. But, uh, I'll say something I completely forgot. Uh, fuck. Whatever. I guess it'll come back to me. <laughs> Hello! Di nuovo. We must I get the damage. I told you those dice again. were lucky. Fortuna wishes she were as good as me. Your no dice are loaded! I do not answer to that name. You gave me loaded Salam. dice? <laughs> Better, but not good enough. Yes! He gave Leonardo, me loaded your dice! Guard, arrest him. him! No. <laughs> Do nice not test food. me. Are you one of Julius's monks? My, My church, church is, is not, not of God. God. I do remember Outside that Outside the kingdom of God is the realm of men. You worship <laughs> there, Messiah? Never. Come with me and find out. <laughs> It has been fun, but I must go. Please, do not depart. The game is not finished. Sorry, but a better offer has arisen. Lead on, Messere. Yeah, those frilly colored freaks are up to no good. The three men from the dice game follow us. Stay quiet. Why? Sentite, okay. I am done playing. So are we! Well, shit! Alright, don't drop below two else four health squares. Okay. Somebody fucking... Yeah, that's cute. Well, there's a lot more than three men here, I just want to say. In fact, there's seven more. Ah! Ah! Okay! You guys should try swapping those fancy robes with some armor. Idiots! Boosh! I win! Didn't get hit once. Bam! Hmm. There is only one man in Roma who can put on a show like that. <laughs> that that? Come. We need to return to Leonardo right away. You do not talk much, do you? No. Nope. Fine. I will run ahead. Uh, you catch up. Oh, uh, okay. He gives no qualms to his personal safety, does he? Excuse me, sir, but I do need your horse. There he is. Salai. Let's read about him. Gian Giacomo Caprotti da Oreno. Blah, blah, blah. Try saying that three times fast. <laughs> I couldn't even say it once. Was apprenticed to Leonardo da Vinci at the ripe young age of ten. Ooh. As evidenced by Leonardo's notes, the two hit it off almost immediately. The second day I had two shirts cut out for him, a pair of hose and a jerkin. And when I've put aside some money to pay for these things, he stole the money out of the purse, and I could never make him confess, although I was quite certain of it. Hmm, yeah. The day after I went to sup with Giacomo Andrea, he said Gian Giacomo supped for two and did mischief for four, for he broke three cruets and spilled the wine. Hmm. Leonardo may have described his apprentice as a thief, liar, obstinate glutton, <laughs> and bestowed him with the nickname Salai, a little devil from the romantic epic Morgante. I don't know what that is. But at the same time, the two were devoted to each other until the master's death. Leonardo helped Salai with his painting compositions, frequently bailing him out of prison, and left half his vineyard to Salai when he died. The apprentice even got to keep the Mona Lisa. Ah. Either this was true love, or Salai had one hell of a sugar daddy. <laughs> God damn it, Sean. Alright, allow me to take your horse now, please. Hermeticists. Assholes who think they're cool in hood, but only I am cool in hood. So, yeah, that's basically all we need to know. The fuck do you think you're do- What? I don't even know who saw me, but good luck catching me on horseback! Well, I take that back immediately. Okay, uh, see ya. Do not drop below four health squares. I think I get it now. I can shoot you on horseback with a crossbow, can I not? Oh, shit. I can't shoot from behind, though. They have to be in front of me. And I don't want to risk them getting too close to me. I don't know if they'll hit me or not. I don't remember how this game works. They are catching up, however, so that's- Oh my god, there's so many of them! Lifts! What did I do? I'm being chased by guys! I'm not doing shit, I'm just trying to run away. Thank you for being impartial, sirs. Alright, you know what? Fuck, close enough. Let's see if they're trying to catch me now! Ha 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 ha! I think- Yeah, the objective's right next to me, so... 
Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it. Please let there be a roof guard. What? Oh, it locked onto them immediately after I got off the horse. Brilliant. Wee! Okay, I lost them. I lost them. Hello, Sally! These strangers do not quit. No, they don't. Disciples wearing similar robes appeared once before. They sought an object I had in my possession. Uh -huh. You mean the piece of Eden? Yeah. Leonardo told you. Tells me everything. Dear me. I fear his indiscretion has cost us greatly. We must warn him. Say no more. I know the best route home. I take it every morning after the taverns close. Follow me. Good job. Oh, okay. I'm back. I'm trying to turn on my lamp, but I think the bulb's dead. So fuck me. All right, I just need to keep an eye on my webcam to make sure it doesn't go fuzzy again. Let's go back to Leonardo's workshop, following Salai, protecting him with our lives. Try not to drop below four health squares. This is where it's gonna get hard, I know. I'm going around. That, that's what she said. I will follow you. <gasps> oh. How did they not see me? <laughs> How about some fun on the rooftops? Leonardo sure. told me that he had discovered something important. He has been exploring a hidden catacomb for years now. I think he came to Roma to find That's it. That's exciting. You have no idea what he is like. He works on this all the time. He never takes me out. And he's so cheap. I have to beg him for money. <laughs> or he steal actually it. gives coins to you? More or less. What he does not know will not hurt him. Allora, you're from Firenze. Tell me more. Oh, get down! Fine. I will use my imagination. Yeah, my parents' family were killed. It sucks. That's basically it. I've killed people ever since. <laughs> oh. It is too early in the day for fighting. Yeah, we're not going Follow that way. Follow me. Back up to the roofs. <laughs> He's so cheap. Leonardo he discovered something in the catacombs. Something he read about in his books. Okay, thanks for interrupting me. I've not seen him bitch. that excited in years. Did he say anything else? That the temple contains the perfect number. Something discovered by some scholar from Grecia. Pythagoras. The perfect number. Attack! It's not case my blade. Fibonacci number? I don't know if that's the perfect number, but. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, somebody tried to hit me. That's cute. I'm getting them. Just give me a second. Fix my blade. Want to get back quick, bitch? Avoid their sword. Well, pff, you Lord ran into Leonardo. me. I suppose he spoke of his discovery to whomever Oops. would listen. Did you notice yeah, any robbed bad. men around him? Why would I spend my time at the workshop when I can go out and have fun? Ask the master himself when we get there. A model apprentice, Sally. A model apprentice, John Jacob. <laughs> Woohoo! Pardon me, Sally. <laughs> I actually didn't mean to do that, but that was still funny. Okay. Are we there yet? <sighs> oh. Do not see me. I'm everywhere and nowhere at once. I am invisible. Maybe a little bit. Move! Minstrel fuck! Are we there yet? My wife I think we might be close. This looks like we are close. Yes, this is it. Okay. And we're back to ask Leonardo some questions. Bye! Yeah. Maestro! They took him. No! He must be here! The temple he discovered. Where is it? Leonardo. Salai, you he want to save so him? Tell me where the you. temple is. I do not know. Cazzo. Ezio, something is written on the floor. What does it say? Mm -hmm. I cannot read. Titi Leonardo Titi promised to teach villa. me, but now. Villa. Paintings. He wants us to examine art. I remember when Leonardo lived at your villa, he was researching the location of the catacombs. Several of his paintings hung in the gallery there. What do they have to do with the temple? 
Perhaps the pages of his research are hidden in one of the frames. The paintings are gone. They all burned in the attack. No, they did not. Only Leda and St. John, the Borgia, took the rest. Six paintings. Five. I told the art merchant that portrait of a lady was by Leonardo. I needed the money for a doublet. Hmm. Of course, now it has gone out of fashion. <laughs> Where's the paintings now? Lucrezia Borgia, in her husband's palazzo outside Ferrara. Yep. Then it is time I took back what was stolen. We're gonna go see that freaky bitch again. And take back what is ours! Kind of. <laughs> she did. I Legally, I think. They sold it to her. But, whatever. We need to go get it back. So we're going to Ferrara. Let's go. Poor Sally. He sounds so worried when he calls out for Leonardo. I do remember that, too. It, just, it made me sad. At the end of this playthrough, like, after the divi like, as soon as we're done, I might have to do one more thing. Um. Oh, God. It's gonna be so fucking funny. If I remember to do it. <laughs> I think I've mentioned it a couple times in videos or something, but uh, oh god, it's like one of my favorite Assassin's Creed moments ever, and it's like not even part of the main campaigns or anything, you, it's sort of like something you accidentally discover, um, and it's so fucking funny, so I'm gonna have to find that for you guys, because it wouldn't make any sense, it involves talking to Leonardo, it invo involves sitting on a bench talking to Leonardo, so uh, it wouldn't exactly make much sense now since he's missing, so we'll have to wait until... The end of the- Oops! I keep hitting my trigger in V to jump off of things. I'm sorry. I'm used to Syndicate. I apologize. Okay, we're going to Ferrara. We're out of here! That gate looks familiar, don't it? <laughs> Miguelito's troops mass behind me. We will take back my city once and for all. This is not your city anymore. Yeah, that whole spiel happened right there. Eh. All right, here we go. Bel Riguardo, 1506. Actually, it's in this sequence right here. It's another one of my favorite Assassin's Creed moments. This DLC was fantastic. It also came with a bunch of multiplayer features. I never got into Brotherhood multiplayer, but still, I got the characters and stuff, and I played what little I did with my friends. It was fun. The one who got away. Infiltrate Bel Riguardo Palazzo to find Lucrezia Borgia, and discover the locations of the stolen villa paintings. Full sink, don't kill anyone. <laughs> well, fuck me. Uh, there she is. Did you have an enjoyable ride, Duquesa? Hardly. I raced across the grounds at breakneck speed for fear of a knife in my back. I do not understand, Duquesa. Who is trying to kill you? My father kept them at bay. Kept me safe. Now they chase after me. They want my head. But, Signora, what the fuck? The countryside was supposed to be serene. Death follows me even here. Increase the patrols and warn me of any intruders. No one is allowed in the palazzo but my husband's private guard. Well, all right then. You heard the Duquesa. I assume the Tell disciples the are chasing her too, because they know of the painting. Oh, His wife has gone mad. But why would they try to kill her if they? Just want the painting. Being detected will cause desynchronization. Shit! Okay, god damn it. How did I do this last time? Fuck. Oh, that was probably not good. Oh, this is really not good. And I have my social status indicator turned off. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. No, Ezio. Yep, no, this is it for me! This is it for me! Get up there, dude! Oh. Nope! They detected me after I went around the wall! Fan-fucking-tastic! Thanks, game! <sighs> I hate it when that happens. They were, like, looking at me like, Who is that guy? And it wasn't until after I was out of their sight that they are like, It's him! You suck. Okay. So how do I do this? Maybe not go into the fucking haystack. Oh, I could have gone up right there. Okay. I hate this camera angle into the thing. Okay, yeah, I just made it harder for myself last time, but that doesn't make what happened any less stupid because I did make it inside. Okay. Wow, there's a lot of angry in here. 
Okay, staying above ground. Do not kill anyone. Oh, I hear shites, but no distractions. Oh, damn it. What did I just say about getting on the ground? Okay, now's my chance. Go, 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 go. Oh, God. Get it! Seems all very, very conveniently set up. So I feel like I'm doing good, but also I feel like the game's kind of expecting me to go this way. So it's not really that impressive. Where do I go now? Over here. What the hell is that noise? Shut up. Let me focus. Whee! I love those things. What is the meaning of this? Especially with the hook playing in the next game. I am supposed to shine the Duquesa's shoes. No one is allowed in the palazzo. Is she going to shine her own shoes then? What the Duquesa does or does not do is of no concern to us. What a night this is. Let me tell you. <laughs> I would rather you did not. I will complain to the Duke. As long as you are stuck on that side, no one will hear you. I have had enough. Stay where you are. Let me through! You must wait until the Duquesa allows you to pass. What the heck is going on? Hello? Okay. Yeah, once we get inside the palazzo and actually make it to Lucrezia, it's one of my favorite moments. It's just, it's just pure 100% Ezio. It's just, it's fantastic. Oh. God. Okay. Convenient holes in walls. Alrighty. So I guess the, uh, the disciples must be after Lucrezia because they know about the painting, just like I do. Maybe. <laughs> I don't fucking know, but why they would kill her, it doesn't exactly guarantee them entrance to the palazzo, but I don't fucking know. I assume that's why they're after her, but I don't understand the reason behind it. It'd be after the painting, if anything. Okay, here we go. They will never see me. And then we move over. Like that. This part's a bitch. The garden is a son of a bitch. If I remember right. Open window. Parfait. Okay. God damn it. Mm -hmm. I believe that Luca has borrowed guards from the Pope himself to watch over his palazzo. Julius has lent Alfonso his guards. You don't know things. Thank you. Okay. Okay. That wasn't so bad at all. <laughs> and we're in. Hello, Lucrezia. Come to kill me at last, assassino. Buongiorno, Lucrezia. Or should I say, Duquesa. A borrowed title bestowed by my husband. Ill-fitting and barely concealing the truth. You can keep your life. I am here for the art on your walls. Redecorating, are we? I yeah, found five kind of. Leonardo da Vinci paintings you have stolen, and I want them returned. <laughs> if only it were that easy. My birthplace, my family, have been taken from me. You think Ferrara loves me? I am a stranger, a castaway, an orphan. Your paintings are gone, assassino. I do not believe you. Frightening, is it not? To have lost so much? I've lost paintings. Perhaps we can comfort each other. Perhaps. Oh, Ezio. Where are the paintings? Sold to Francesco Colonna. And one to someone who was special to me. Fraternizing with the enemy, the bro. Ezio. He spends his time near Il Vaticano. I kept one for myself. Where is it? Give it to me. Guards! <laughs> Place Da Vinci's Annunciation in a cart. Leave it outside the walls. All right. Well, thanks, woman. Molto bene. Now, close your eyes. Woo! My 
husband will soon arrive with his guards, so it is best if you... <laughs> Forgive me, Duquesa. What for? No man can heal your pain. You must do so on your own. Say hello to the Duca for Say me. Say hello to the Duca for me. <laughs> yeah! God, I love that so much! <laughs> You're so smooth! Have some of that, you bastards! I'm fucking out of here! Pardon! Woo! Yeah, don't kill anyone, so I can't fight. I just gotta get the fuck out of here. Which I do believe is accomplished by going up! Faster! Little faster! Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck me. Okay, this way. Going this way. Oh, they lost me temporarily. Fuck. I should just stop trying to do the Italian accent. I can't fucking do it. Pardon. Ah! Perfect. Well done, you might fall. Yay! Hopefully, I won't be needing it. Okay. Ezio, get the fuck up there. Thank you. Back. Woo! I was actually not expecting to make that. I thought I jumped too early. Nope, I'm good. I'm so damn good. Jump. Up. All right, here we go. And we have escaped with two minutes to spare. Damn. Okay. And we land right next to the carpet to paint it. Okay, what if five paintings acquired? Let's actually, let's read about it. The Archangel Gabriel appears to Mary, revealing to her that she will conceive Jesus Christ. The setting is the enclosed courtyard garden of a Florentine villa. Leonardo made several mistakes in perspective within this composition, showing it that at the age of 20, he was still learning. What, it, perspective? Let's see what you mean by perspective. I mean, it's not bad at all. What perspective issues there are. I suppose the corner of the wall behind her, too. What perspective issues there are, are still aren't that bad. That's inspiring, though. At the age of 20, the great Leonardo da Vinci was still learning, but still selling very famous paintings. All right, 100% sync! Beast! And we have four more paintings left to go, which Lucrezia has so lovingly given us the locations of. Thanks, girl! Uh, and I love that scene. First time I saw it, I was like, Ezio, what are you doing? Like, I was freaking out. And then I saw what he was doing, and I was like, oh, okay. You're smooth. Well done. Well played, good sir. <clears throat> Actually, yeah, that's the perfect ending to this episode, because I am all out of time. So, I hope you guys are enjoying our... God damn it, why is it every time I have to address my audience, they put me right in front of a fucking herald? Just, just shut up. Let me find a quiet spot. So I think that this is a good place to stop, ladies and gents. I hope you guys are enjoying the Da Vinci Disappearance DLC of Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Like and favorite if you are, subscribe if you want to see more, and I will see you in my next video. Farewell, friends. Did you just really? I don't even just... What? Oh, maybe that's what this like. Whatever, just fuck you guys. A couple of these, yeah? Huh? All of you. All of you. Just move all you want. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Just kidding. <laughs>